can now push the ball deep. Is it? If your opponent hitting very spin, right? Then you're pushing. If your opponent play like very pushing, right? You can do in both. You can do push also, you can do spin also. But normally I recommend push. Because in doubles, it's push easier to pressure your opponent. It's like this one, you're pushing. Okay, you need to feel let the ball stay in your racket. So technically, you are not slapping. You just lock out and swing. Swing. Plus the strength from come from opposite, right? Should be strong enough already. Then this is the second part I'm going to say. You didn't pull high enough. See ah, uh, like this one, short right? But I just pull high a bit. High a bit. Okay, okay, ready. Most of people, right? They all focus on practice left and right placement, but they're not really focused on how control how high. Yeah. So what you need to do is actually just control higher. Then cannot be too high. So this is the experience to control feeding. Then you try first control. Yeah. What about more higher? Don't don't be there so high. I want you to play with the same strength. Don't just go soft. Not deep enough, right? Just go a little bit higher. Little bit higher. Why you become spinning? Pull high doesn't mean go spin. Okay, we are. Control high low. <laughs> Control high and low by by your how your racket swing. You go like that. Go like that. Go like that. It's not saying that you want to go high, you twist it up. Twist is for spin. Don't twist is for pushing. But you can go twist in front, twist higher, twist more higher, or push in front. Push higher, push more higher. So technically, you just lock out your wrist. Lock. Aha, uh -huh. that's the way. Then low, low down a bit. Why I I teach you to adjust high, not increase your strength, right? Is because go harder, easy mistake. So we play the way you feel confident. Don't need to add your strength. Then you just need to increase the high. So you see why? Yeah. Yeah. Yes, either like that. But this one, it will be too slow. This is why, if you want to play with the spin, that means what? Increase harder. Yeah, either you just go pushing. Okay, because you see, I played 30% of my strength equal 50% my strength to spin. See, like same strength, right? Uh, same speed, right? But when I play spin, I need to play harder. That's the problem. Also, it's because you're holding like that already. Oh, right. oh it's too much spin. Yeah. I only hold like that. Your one is like that. Right. Yeah, because like this one, you automatic twist, right? But another way is why you flip open. Oh. Either change your grip, your habit, either just train to play like this. You're easier pushing. No worry, no worry, it's okay. It's like that one. So you flip open, you don't need to pull up. That's why I need to train. If you flip already, right? You flip open, swing in front. Don't go high. Strong, right? I recommend don't change your grip, because uh, this is your habit already. So you just need to try to open a bit, use your wrist, then to play like this. Because normally you never play like this, right? You never flip, right? That's why you don't know how high you will go. Roughly need to swing how high. Yeah, to get the experience. Yeah. So when you play, you just need to open a little bit. Don't go like purely like 12 and 6. A little bit can already. 